Hello, this is Lars from Native Instruments. In this video, we will explain how to record MIDI notes in your DAW from your Machine controller using the Machine MIDI mode. In this example, we are using Ableton Live as a DAW, but the same workflow applies to all other DAWs. First, in your DAW, load an instance of Machine 2 into a software instrument track. Here, we load the stereo version in Ableton Live. Next, go into Machine 2. In the browser, go to Groups and make sure the Load Patterns button is deactivated. Load a kit of your choice. Here, we are loading the 909 kit. In the control area, choose Group and then click the channel icon. Choose Input, and under MIDI, choose Manual as the key mode, and Host as the source. Leave Channel on All. If you are using the Machine Mark III, set the start note to C3. If using any other controller, leave it at C1. Now, switch your Machine to MIDI mode. For the Machine Mark 1 and Mark 2, hold Shift and press Control. For the Machine Mark 3 or Studio, hold Shift and press Channel. If you are using a Machine Micro Mark 1 or Mark 2, hold Shift and press F1. And if you are using the Micro Mark 3, hold Shift and press the Project button. If you are using the Machine Mark III or Micro Mark III, you can already start playing and record the Machine sounds with the pads of your controller in your DAW. For the other Machine controllers, we must set the correct octave for the pads to play on. If you choose Group A, your Machine pads will trigger the MIDI notes starting from C-1. Group B starting from C-0, group C starting from C1, and so forth. As the root note of the group inside Machine 2 was set to C1, press Group button C. Now, your Machine pads will trigger the notes from C1 to D sharp 2. This means that when you press your first Machine pad, sound 1 will be triggered, second Machine pad triggers sound 2, and so on. To change the group of the Machine Micro, hold down the Group button and press one of the pads. Choose Group C by pressing Pad 15. You can now play your kit on Machine and record the notes directly into your DAW.